Here we go. Come on, Jamal. You got to pick it up if you want to win this thing. <laughs> and I'm predicting Pineda to win. I'm totally stuck in the middle on this one. Oh. A low leg kick, and Pineda shoves him back and says, no, no, get out of here. Oh, big left. Jamal Hill's in trouble. This is what I worried about for Jamal. And Pineda's pounds away with the hammer fist, and it's over. And look at this. Herb Dean's got to push him back. Jamal Hill gets finished, and that's it. Jamal Hill says, why'd you stop it? But, no, I mean, I don't think he realizes what just happened. But Ada just rocked Jamal Hill and just kind of pounded away five, six, eight times maybe, and Padetta's pumped up, and he's at his height right now. And now, like Padetta said, he's ready to go with 301. And if he gets a first-round finish, you never know. <coughs> Could he fight Ankalaev at UFC 301? He could easily return in a month, whether they want him to do that or not. And he's getting a black belt. Wow. Unbelievable. And Alex Padetta with a dominant performance. Jamal Hill, you know, had to take this fight, but probably came back too early, let's be real. And that's exactly what I figured would happen. You're going to see Jamal Hill at a different level in the next fight, just like you saw Yuri tonight. And you know Jamal Hill's not happy with this, but Panetta shoved off Herb Dean. And this is when Herb Dean comes in and says, Time. And Panetta says, Nope, nope. Put his arm out and shoved him back. And Herb said, Okay. And right away, boom, lands a left within two seconds. And that's when Jamal Hill's in serious trouble. Look at this. Beam. <clears throat> and it only takes one. Yeah, dude. Yeah, he had him right on that left. Jamal Hill went down hard. And then he came in at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep. And it was basically over. Seven hammers to finish it. Alex Pineda is the definitive champ. Unbelievable. He's 10-2. He'll retain the belt here. Light heavyweight division. That was quick at UFC 300.